SyncML is the former name for a platform independent information synchronization standard. The project is currently referred to as Open Mobile Alliance Data Synchronization and Device Management. The purpose of SyncML is to offer an open standard as a replacement for existing data synchronization solutions, which have mostly been somewhat vendor, application or operating system specific. Internals, SYNCML works by exchanging commands, which can be requests and responses. As an example, the mobile sends an alert command for signaling the wish to begin a refresh-only synchronization, the computer responds with a status command for accepting the request, the mobile sends one or more sync command containing an add subcommand for each item. If the number of entries is large, it does not include the tag. In the latter case, the computer requests to continue with an appropriate alert message, and the mobile sends another chunk of items. Otherwise, the computer confirms it received all data with a status command, commands are grouped into messages. Each message and each of its commands has an identifier, so that the pair MSG id, CMD id uniquely determine a command. Responses like status commands include the pair identifying the command they are responding to. Before commands, messages contain a header specifying various data regarding the transaction. An example message containing the alert command for beginner refresh synchronization, like in the previous example, is the response from the computer could be an XML document like. The transaction then proceeds with a message from the mobile containing the sync command, and so on. This example is a refresh where the mobile sends all its data to the computer and nothing in the other way around. Different codes in the initial alert command can be used to initiate other kinds of synchronizations. For example, in a two way sync, only the changes from the last synchronization are sent to the computer which does the same. The last and next tags are used to keep track of a possible loss of sync. Last represents the time of the last operation of synchronization, as measured by each device. For example, a mobile may use progressive numbers to represent time, while the computer uses strings like 201401122T213401Z. Next is the current time in the same representation. This latter data is stored and then compared with last in the next synchronization. Any difference indicates a loss of sync. Appropriate actions involving sending all data can be then taken to put the devices back in sync. Anchors are only used to detect a loss of sync, they do not indicate which data is to be sent. Apart from the loss of sync case, in a normal sync, each device sends all changes since the last synchronization. Sync ML Client Connectors and Plugins Sync ML Servers, 1 SAN equals Server Alert Notification This Sync ML Push technology is based on definitions by the Open Mobile Alliance and extends the existing Sync ML protocol specification by offering a method of server-initiated synchronization. Sync ML Hosted Services See also, iCalendar, the Sync ML Initiative, Funamble free and open sourcing ML server software. Open Sync, free and open source synchronization software written with C language. Yahoo! Mobile and Yahoo! Calendar, Yahoo! services offered in some countries that uses Sync ML technology. Critical Path Sync ML server, CalDAV, CardDAV. References